The trade deadline is over, probably one of the worst, if not the worst, trade deadlines in NBA history. Only a few teams made trades, and the Bucks were one of them. The Bucks just traded for Patrick Beverly from the 76ers, giving up campaign and a second round pick. Now the Bucks might have just made the best move this trade deadline, and this could be the piece that makes them serious contenders for a championship this season. But of course, let me explain why. Before this season, the Bucks traded Drew Holiday, one of their best defenders, a player who made both the All-NBA and All-Defensive team last season, for Damian Lillard. Now. The Bucks' defense has been their biggest problem all season. They went from 4th in defense last season to 18th this season. However, despite their bad defense, the Bucks are currently the second seed in the East, and that's because the Bucks' offense is elite and has been keeping them at the top of the East, where they're ranked 4th in offensive rating in the league. The Bucks recently hired Doc Rivers, hoping that a coaching change could be the fix for their problems, but the Bucks have been struggling going 1-4 since hiring Doc Rivers. Obviously, the Bucks need time to adjust to Doc Rivers and will surely make a run once they do, but now that they added an elite perimeter to Defender, a role they've been missing badly this season. The Bucks might be a problem this season and might have enough to seriously take down the Celtics and compete for a championship. Pat Bev will surely take some pressure off of Damian Lillard, who hasn't had the best season so far, but now that Dame won't likely have to guard the other team's first or second option, he will have a lot more energy on the offensive end and he will definitely start to look like the Damian Lillard we all know. The Bucks most likely will try to use Pat Bev the same way they did Drew Holiday and it'll be interesting to see how they do it. Anyways, that's all for this video. If you enjoyed, leave a like and subscribe and I'll catch you on the next one.